Now, here's your Pentagon Channel report. Defense Secretary Robert Gates says the increased production of F-35 Joint Strike Fighters will have a positive impact on jobs in the aerospace industry over the next several years. Secretary Gates told reporters Monday that tens of thousands of jobs will be created as work transitions from the F-22 to the F-35. The F-22 has 24,000 direct employees this year, 19,000 in 10, 13,000 in 11. The F-35 already has 38,000 employees, so it already is hiring 13,000 more than the F-22. That will go to 62,000 or 64,000 in FY10 and 82,000 in FY11 if we don't drain money away from it. Secretary Gates said if properly supported, the F-35 can become the backbone of America's tactical aviation fleet for decades to come. And stay with us today on the Pentagon Channel for all your latest military news. On the next edition of Around the Services, Defense Secretary Gates is calling for an increase of 22,000 soldiers to ease the stress on the force. We'll have a report. And on downrange, highlights from today's briefing from Iraq with the commander of Multinational Division, Baghdad.